Duck hunting involves a lifetime of learning. You pick up things from your dad and other friends and family along the way. And there's stages to a hunter's evolution. First, the shooter. It just loves to burn shells. Then the limit chaser, when numbers matter and you'll grind a hole till dark if you have to. Then the trophy hunter, who'll go just about anywhere to get the hard ones. And eventually, the sportsman. When you've hunted enough to satisfy the instinct, you become a dad and you're ready to pass on what you've learned. Of the thousands of hunts you'll go on in your lifetime, there's one you never forget. That first hunt, when you got your first duck. Now, you may not be set to take a kid on his first hunt this year, but someday you probably will. And chances are, years ago around this time, someone was gearing up to take you on that hunt when you got your first duck. So this one's for the folks that showed us the ropes. It's the story of getting that first one. The first time you take your kid along on a hunt, it won't be quite what you expect because you're not hunting. You're babysitting an armed child in the woods and it will make you nervous. But when you hunt like all of us, your kids grow up around it, posing for pictures at an age when no one really believes they shot those ducks. Yes, hold it just like this for a picture. All right, I'll Henry, just look at me. Just look at me. Pick hold the ducks up. up. Pick the ducks up. There you go. Don't, don't. Well, at that age, it's hard keeping their attention. It's mostly tears and complaining early on. So you try to find different ways to make it exciting for them. But as they grow up, and they come on more hunts, you start to get a glimpse of what sort of outdoorsman they're gonna be. Oh no, trip! I thought you were good, buddy. Don't throw it! Eventually, they start to get it, they pick up the gun safety concepts, and then one season, you'll start to wonder if they're ready. But when's the right time? And how do you know when they're ready? There's two main things to consider, strength and accuracy. They've gotta be strong enough to shoulder a gun, and in the off season, they should be able to hit an old decoy with some consistency. Nice, nice, dude. There's a few good options for lightweight youth shotguns. What kind of gun is that? I do not know, I forgot. It's a pump action 410. Okay, I don't care, Hammy. The Mossberg 410 youth pump and the Rossi Crack Barrel 410. The guns are cheap, and depending on your kid, a few further adjustments to the stock can help them improve their draw. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. And then finally, one morning, all the preparation, all the planning, all the years of fetching ducks and watching from the sidelines gets put to the test. And it's the morning of their first real duck hunt. I'm so proud of you. All right, you want to go get the duck? Yeah. All right, what is it? Wood duck. Female wood duck. Exactly right. Raise it up. Awesome, man. Let's go show mom. I'm proud of you, buddy. As a dad, you have a responsibility to teach your kids life as you've experienced it. 
and show them all the best things you've seen. You can't control where they go or if they'll take what you've shown them and love it like you do, but you've done your part when you take them out there, spend time in the setup, talk about the theory, and give them the experience of their first real hunt. No matter where they go or what they do, they'll take those memories with them and they'll hold them dear. So here's to growing up in the field, standing with your dad, learning about the important stuff. From their very first duck hunt to the last hunt you share together, it's not just the birds you're chasing, it's the time. And you can ask any dad. That time is precious and brief. So get out there and enjoy it. Make the plans, gather the troops, because it's time to get back out there.